Um, I'm Sam today with Dr. Peter Fardy, um, and we're here talking about religious studies. Um, in a world full of worries about employability, worries about money, why would somebody go to either to sixth form or especially to university? Why study religious studies now? Why does it still matter as a subject? Two major reasons. Firstly, there are fundamental questions that one needs to ask as a human being. Is there any meaning to life? Do we have freedom? Is there a life after death? Now, those aren't easy questions, but they are fundamental to what the heck life is here about and what we're here for. Is there a God? So I think those are questions worth asking individually. But secondly, in almost every area, if you're going to be a doctor, ethics is hugely important. Increasingly, genetic engineering is going to be important. If you go into war, the whole issue of the justice of war, how wars should be fought are important. If you go into business, the whole area of business ethics is becoming increasingly important. In politics, ethics and philosophy underpin almost every discipline. If you want to get into the media, do a degree in philosophy or religious studies because underneath Harry Potter, underneath almost every film, are ethical and philosophical issues. Thank you, and I, I completely agree. I think those issues are inescapable. And the only thing I would really kind of add to that is that people I know who studied philosophy can argue, and to at least to some extent, they can win at arguments. They kind of got those abilities, and that's quite an important rhetorical skill. Yes, but it can also be, and Socrates was very critical about rhetoricians, people who are experts at arguing. I think if philosophy is going to mean anything, it's got to have an impact on the individual. Otherwise, what the heck's the point of doing it? One is raising profound questions about what the heck we're here for, and I think at some level, if it doesn't affect how we behave and the sort of person we are, it becomes a bit like tiddlywings. Thank you.